uncomfortable piece of defending. Oh my goodness, what a goal! Yes, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Goals Bible. This is Real Madrid FIFA Career Mode Episode 2. We've done a lot in Episode 1. If you missed Episode 1, please do check that out. It was just insane. But let me just quickly review what we did in the last episode. Okay, so we won the Super Cup. That was the first trophy available for Real Madrid and we won it. Uh, one against uh, Mallorca, one against Atletico Madrid, and drawn against uh, Real Sociedad. So that is a massive game, by the way, massive game. We were losing by three goals to nail when we came back and draw that game 3-3. So it was unbelievable. But what do we have coming up next? Uh, Celta Vigo is coming up. Uh, Leipzig uh, is coming up in the group stage in the Champions League. Espanol is also coming up. We got Real Betis coming up. So a lot to look forward to. Obviously, the aim is to win La Liga and to win the Champions League. And you already know we are playing ultimate level. Take a look at the standings really quickly before we get started. So Real Madrid, currently we are third. Only drawn one game. Barcelona and Getafe have won all their games. So they have nine points and we have seven points. So we can close the gap. We can definitely close the gap, but let's go. Let's go. Before we get started, you already know what to do, guys. Smash a like on the stream. Subscribe to the channel if you're new to the channel. 442, they're playing 442. I think we need to adjust a little bit for them. First game. Always tough. Always tough. Vinny. Oh, this is what he does. This is what he does. Mbappe! Let's make Mbappe do the zoo. Let's make him do the zoo. One nil. What a start to the stream. Mbappe has scored again. Bang. But it was all down to Vinicius Jr. I mean, Vinicius Jr. just took out two players. He took out two players. Let's get him on the counter. Vinicius Jr. Vinicius Jr. Vinny. Vinicius. Vinicius. And that is the to two. Toenail Vinicius Jr. scores. Oh, oh, oh. oh no, come on, man. Come on, man. I took the ball away. I hate this, man. I hate this from FIFA. Look, I defended it properly and somehow it just stays there. Game on. Rodrigo. <sighs> but that is a full time. Massive three points. Massive three points. Let's go. Let's just quickly take a look at the standing for the Champions League because Okay, Laps, uh, Leipzig, Shakhtar, and Celtic. That is the group we are in. Okay, we're going to have to play Kamavinga as a left back because we just don't have cover. I think we're good. I think I like this lineup. I really like this lineup. All right, game two, let's go. This is the night both sets of supporters have been waiting for. Not long now until kickoff on match day one in the Champions League. In the UEFA Champions Hasta League. Hasta final. Vamos, Real. Let's go. My goodness. This is a dangerous team. I can sense it. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Ooh, Mbappe Costa's there. Mbappe losing the ball in a dangerous area there. And Cuckoo. Mamma mia. Well, let's take another look. If you lose it's the Mbappe ball, losing the ball. Get An unnecessary That's position the there. No chance for Courtois. What might we see in this section? Well, you don't look too much further than Real Betis. Oh, good, good save. And they've got some great individuals. Having said... Really inventive stuff from Real here. Oh, what an attempt from Vinicius Jr. Trying to deliver it accurately. That was outstanding. Mbappe again. Right on the goal line. 
Bellingham nearly scored his first goal for Real Madrid. What a goal! Oh my goodness, what did I just witness? Unbelievable goal! Unbelievable goal! Oh my days! That is just stunning! I mean, stunning goal! Wow. Ooh. Mbappe. 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 Tell on. Let's go. Can't save that. You just can't save that. But that first goal we scored from. Ah, uh, Brahimi is just insane. It's just insane. Look at Modric. Mbappe, yes sir. Yes sir. We're just getting started. This step so too bad. He could score a hundred goals. I'm telling you, he can. He can. He is that good. The best player on the planet now. There's no question about that. Oh, are you serious? Who's that? That's Timo Werner. This guy doesn't even score. And he's scoring with one shot. Courtois, what are you doing, bro? From three, three one down, and they, they they tied the game now. Oh wow, come on, Vinga, you gotta jump there. You just gotta jump there, bro. Not the greatest pass, easily intercepted. Oh, ref, ref. Oh, Tony Cross. This is Real Madrid, boy. Just put him in as well. I just put him in as well. Insane shot. Insane goal. Tony Cross with his left foot as well. Bang. Get it. Oh, it is a goal. Benny Gillen scored his last goal. Come on! I mean, Mbappe took a shot from a very difficult angle. The easy finish there for Bellingham. He can't get any easier chance than that. And the Real Madrid shirt, the that is it all over. That's a W, baby. Win. A massive win. Massive win. We might need this guy. You know, we might need him. But let's go. Look at Kylian. What do you guys think about him, by, by the way? Do you think Kylian Mbappe is going to join Real Madrid? Do let me know in the chat, people. Mbappe! Wow! How is he missing from there? Oh, his tummy's on side. Vinny, one now. Vinicius Jr. You can't stop Vinicius Jr. and Mbappe. You just can't. That leg cup is just insane. I keep saying it. Vinicius Jr. You could do it again. Vinny. Vinny. Oh, it should be 2 now. Mbappe, there it is. Again, it's all down to Vinicius Jr. setting up the goal for Valverde. 
Vinicius Junior. Well, no stop again. Oh, this is what Vinny does. Yes, Mendy scores again, but it is all down to Vinicius Junior yet again. Taking out one, two, three, four players out of the game with that pass. And can this tackle there? Four down. That is it. There goes the whistle. It's over. In a couple of days, we have another game. In a couple of days, we have another game. So it's just it's just so difficult okay now Mbappe and Vinicius Jr are rested this is what we wanted all right this is going to be the lineup do let me know if you disagree with with this lineup but let's go they're playing 4-1-4-1 four, one, four, one. so let's see nice Elche have scored against Barcelona put the ball in that's Mbappe Mbappe This is what he does. This is our new number seven, Mbappe. Mbappe! Take a look at this. Outside of the foot. And he still hits the target. What a good goal that is. That is a sweet finish. Ooh. Oh, I knew it. One mistake and it's a goal. One mistake and it's a goal. Mbappé! Hat trick! A masterclass in finishing! Just can't stop him today! Unbelievable player! I'm telling you, you could not stop this guy. You just can't stop this guy. He has done it again, people. Right, news coming through from the Barcelona. Let's go, Valverde! 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 That is a goal! They say it's an old goal, but it's not. It is all down to Valverde. How's Ozelu miss that? Oh, that is so close. Yes, vamos! Three points. Mbappe yet again with another hat trick. Four attempts, three goals. Okay. Real Madrid up top, baby. Six games played, 16 points. It looks like Barcelona have dropped points as well. And Getafe and Villarreal has dropped points as well. So we are up top, 14 goals. Uh, but still the same point. We are still at the same point. So when we started today, we were two points behind and we closed the gap on Barcelona. So that is a good thing. That is a good thing. Let's quickly check out what we got coming up next. Let's not forget, we do have the Supercopa coming up. Semi-final against Valencia. Hopefully we win that game. We already won the uh, Super Cup, as you can see, uh, in the Champions League. One, one game, we played one game and we won that game. So still far off to talk about who's going to win it, who's going to advance. So we'll have to sit and wait gonna happen in that one in our next episode guys in our next episode what we got coming up we got Real Betis coming up we got Celtic coming up in the Champions League also got uh, another difficult fixture Hetafe I believe it's not Hetafe it's uh, Girona and Rayo Vallecano are coming up in the next episode so that is gonna be difficult and also Shakhtar Barcelona are and Valencia are in this October month. So we need to be on point that we need to win all of our games. We need to win all of our games. But that is it for this episode, guys. Do let me know in the comment sections who is your favorite pl uh, player, who needs to start in the next game, and who do you think deserves to start in the next game? Should we continue to put Bellingham on the bench, or does he have to start 
over Luka Modric, dude, let me know in the comment section. But as always, guys, thank you for watching. Smash a like on the stream, subscribe to the channel if you're new to the channel. But I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.